Hello, everybody. <laughs> it is crazy Glenda again. I hope that you all watched or listened. If you didn't, I'll put it in the teal. But I, I hope you listened to Thistles in the Corn yesterday. It's kind, it's folksy, but it's special. At least to me, it is. So, anyway, but we're gonna start Frankenstein tonight. And so we've got the clay out. We won't finish him tonight, but we're sure gonna get as far as we can. So, onward. <laughs> Wish me luck. We are getting ready to make Frankenstein's monster, but we don't. We don't have to call him that. I've been calling him Frankie, but you guys can give me a different name for him. This is this. This is his armature. We won't. We'll get part way done tonight, but we won't get all the way. Okay, this is going to be his body, and then I need arms. He could have long arms. I tell you what, I need a wire that's between this size and the size I'm going to use to hold it together. I have some beading wire that's real thin that I I think I tried it once on doing this but it was just too too thin to hold up to this stuff so I'm using I want to stay in camera as much as possible so holler at me if I don't <laughs> like it'll do any good. Anyway, I'm putting together the arms and the armature that go that for the body. So and then I'll have Joe drill some holes so we can stand him in one of these. Okay. I'm gonna make him kind of blocky. I might give him a little waste, but not too much, because I want him to be kind of blocky. I'm just going to use this to kind of help fill it in a little. Okay. That just helps take up some of the space. Fill it in with this. The ultralight. I don't want him to look fat, just boxy. Just squared off. I'll get a little bit of a cinched in waist, but not too much. Okay, I'm going to put another layer around that.
this ultralight is easier to it's kind of marshmallowy it's not really something you'd want to use on the outside because it's it's very pliable <laughs> but it really makes for a good to build it up and then cover that foil when you use it That should be good there. Okay, I gotta bake this and then we'll come back and I'll start using the Super Sculpey. Okay, I don't want this out here. That has finished baking, but it's cooling off. I'm gonna go ahead and make a head. Uh, make a head. I might have a setting that thin on my spaghetti roller. Okay. This is going to be its head.
have any air blowouts. <laughs> that way, if there's any air pockets in there, it'll escape. So, here is his head. I'm sorry I wasn't very close on that. I kind of had to have my eyes on it. Oh, battery low. Okay. But at least you've seen what the face is shaped like. <laughs> Go on from there. <laughs> For the next day. So, we'll see you then. Love you. Good night. Smile and wave. <laughs>